What is up guys? Welcome back to yet another Dragon Blaze 4th Impact video. And today we're going to be making 2nd um, Impact Heroes, as many as we can, since apparently you can just make them. From the last video I mentioned that. So we're going to be diving into that today. Hope everybody is doing well. And we have new events guys. Very exciting. Your daily aspiration success event. Make sure you're playing, get to lots of good resources here. As you see, you get ruins, infinity artifact summon tickets, which is perfect right now because the new heroes are out. You want to go ahead and make them. And, you know, beginners, if you're looking at this video as well, please make all the second impacts. You can basically probably just make them at this point. So definitely get your roster up along with the rest. But you also get God's Memory, Souls of Kalar, and Rubies. You got your world boss event, which is awesome. Check it out. Log in event and just end it. Kyder in the raid is going to be here for a little bit longer, so make sure you jump into that. Letter of uh, Pages event, same. It's going to be here for a little bit longer, so jump into that. This is very important. Definitely want to com constantly keep getting these, constantly getting pages. Make sure you're doing Katarina's event and investigating because you're going to get a lot of these, and it's a very good reason you do get both of the new heroes cards. Fragment of Memories and more. This one, I don't really participate in this one as much at all. But I may since the since the, the rewards is okay. I don't know. We may jump into that one. Um, it just depends. I usually don't jump into that now. Oh yeah, before that one. And then this one, obviously, your you know your I'd rather call a ruler event. Obviously, like when you mine and stuff like that, you'll get some of these uh as well this will be coming soon you can't do this event just yet but jackpot event guys this event is so good like it is it is awesome so basically as you do your daily missions you get to jackpot event now the blue ones you get the gold ones you don't you actually have to pay for this so you have to pay for that which is very unfortunate but the blue ones you get automatically Make sure you are playing like crazy every day, all day long as this event is going, and even after this event, because this is where it's at. You're going to get a lot of great resources from this. There are so many good events right now so celebrating the new chapter for the game. It's it's unreal. Like There's a lot of good stuff going on right now, guys, so make sure you jump in and make sure you are playing. And now, let's try to get to it. So, second impact characters, as you know, when they first came out, they were incredibly hard to make. You had to get three specific characters, um, three specific characters, actually, to in order to actually make these guys. I keep forgetting you go to skills. So, you need these three characters right here, and you needed to get them to level 30, enchant him up to level 30 and then you fight you know whatever third and whatever second impact and character you're trying to fight and they were hard but they were worth it because when you got them they were over a million plus power and i already have a video about me making her which is why she's a primary example um i'm talking about but now before in third impact you had to get them to level 20 somebody told me that so I still didn't bother. And now fourth impact, I was like, well, I want to be curious. I'm going to try to, you know, get get one of these guys or at least unlock them or something. I want to see if that still stands. And guess what? It doesn't. You can just go ahead and I believe go ahead and fight them because I did make uh, a few of these. I made like two. I unlocked two. But, yep. Yeah. So here, the trials. So, yeah, I, I made one. So I can go ahead and second impact and make, I think I may have made another one. I think I made, I made two, but we're just gonna go ahead and, and just make as many as we can. This is very important too, because there's content, you know, that, that that's out that requires you to have your second impacts. Like when you're doing attack Odyssey, to, uh, Odyssey attack team, when you reach the sixth dungeon, it, it, it requires you, um, to have second impact characters. And it's really tough when you don't. We'll do all the equipment and stuff uh, later. I'll be sure to do that. 
but um, it's so exciting that you can just go ahead and do it. So you go to Room of Trials, and as you see, he's level 20, Hearts is level 20, 37, and this guy right here is level 15. Well, I can already go in and fight. Um, go ahead and fight and make these guys. We just use our fourth impact character as well as well. Go in here and do the room. And it is so awesome that you can do that because I didn't know that you can do that. I was like, well, I just want to see if, you know, the restrictions and stuff still stands. And apparently it does not. So this is very important for not just for me, but for everyone. And I'm not sure everybody even knows this or they really put it out there because not a lot of everybody knows that. And from second impact and third impact, they probably just didn't bother trying to make them. I always mention all the time, hey, don't make these guys yet because they require a lot of resources and and it's really not it's not worth it really at the end of the day to make them because they don't have as much power um starting off like you know they don't have that much compared to before when you did make them for the first time you had each character level 30 specific ones and then you went out and fought them you know they had over a million plus power now as you see i just unlocked this guy and I also made another character as well they didn't have a fraction of of a million power and this is just flat off the back. This is just right out the box. This is not even well. She has a little bit less power than that. I did. I did give her uh, her equipment, I mean, her armor. But yeah, they didn't have any of that. And then when you first got them, like I said, her she was over a billion power. So and they were extremely hard to get. I mean, I'm talking about extremely, extremely hard um, to get. So I'm very happy that they went ahead and changed that because um, it was kind of frustrating wanting to uh wanting to make these characters and it takes an arm and a leg to make them and i'm happy that they didn't make the fourth impact and third impact characters too hard to get either um as far as like the condition wise you know the conditions is was um very much out of control when it comes to trying to make these guys so i'm happy that they changed that because you know, it, it sucks having just the few second impacts I had, and I need a lot more. I need a healer, I need all this, and I'll have all the ones that I will need. Specifically, they're not coming out with any more second impact heroes because we are in the fourth generation, basically, you know, with the fourth impact. So they're going to solely focus on coming out with fourth impact characters and not second or third anymore, I'm quite sure. So... You know, you're in a predicament where you can't even make these guys. It's like, well, how am I going to make them when, you know, when it's just a simple fact that they they just, they take a lot to make. And, you know, and them being level 30 and above, you know, that can take time. And for most people who aren't so active, they can be a lot harder on them. And even ones who are active, you know, because we got to save Ruby, spend them. Like, I'll probably spend a little bit more um, before um, the rates are over, the rates up are over. I'll probably spend a little bit more, um, try to get some more hero packs for these guys. So, but yeah, we're making these real quick, as many as we can, because that is just, uh, that is so awesome and it's so exciting. And we're just going to fly through the story and stuff like that. It's not really that important. Mm. We're just trying to make as many as we can for the, for the time that we have. And then and if I can't make them all, which I should be able to make them all, we'll, we'll also power them all up immediately. I put the equipment and stuff on, you know, off camera. But hope everybody's doing well. Please jump into these events. These are all banger events beginners veterans returning like please jump on these events there's a ton of stuff to do you're going to get a lot of resources if you're very active right now and even before but now whew, man these events are so good so so good each one so this is what i mean by getting resources grinding because this is a grinding game it requires you to get on it, re it requires your attention to play because if you don't play, you're not going to get very far. And then if you're not active, you're going to miss out on events just like this. So just imagine how many resources you're missing just because you're not getting on and playing.
I mean, it's, 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 quite, it's quite insane. Especially for the new characters, you know, there's lots of resources they're giving us, as you just saw, for the new characters. Jackpot is, is, has all the new characters in it and then some of the resources and more, along with Katarina's stuff too, which is also very important. She gives you more resources. I did a Katarina, Katarina event yesterday video that showcased all that stuff. And I did more of it today and got more pages and got more resources for my new characters and more. So it's highly important to jump on and play. You do not want to miss out on stuff right now. Man, it feels so good to be able to make these guys. Like, I'm not even joking because, you know, I thought I was never going to get a chance to make these because your third impact characters and now fourth impact characters are way more important. They're way more stronger to have. So you're going to put your time and resources uh, towards them. And not towards your second or first impact characters. Depending on if you are new or semi-new, you know, you're going to have to put your resources wherever you can. But still, and as you're buying, you know, packs and stuff like that, or listening to me, waiting till the rates are up, you're going to get a lot more uh, bang for your buck mm. whenever you're spending your heart on hard earned rubies they'll go a long way if you listen to me because that's the only time you're going to see me spending rubies on packs at least so you won't really see me spending um rubies on anything else outside of that other than armors which i spent quite a bit on armors i gotta spend i gotta spend more on armors too but right now i'm trying to get them a lot more stronger because unlock their abilities and Unlock um, star power of knowledge as well. So that's kind of what we're focusing on, other than all the awesome events that's going on. And every type of character, first, second, third, and now fourth, they're all very important to make. Mm. Eventually, you're going to make all of them. Because they are very important to make. They may not seem very powerful, but they make content so you can use these characters. So, and if they want them in the more in the forefront, they'll make more content for these characters. Again, Odyssey attacking team. When you get to the sixth dungeon, you have to use second impact characters. You can't use first, or third, and or fourth now. You can only use second, so very important that you have those because they also have the highest tier armor in the game, which is your triple S armor. There's no armor higher than that since, you know, you know, second impact, they had ultimate armor, which they had raids for that, which kind of sucks they took that out. But now it is so important to have these because you need to get your triple S armor. And that's the only way to get it right now quickly versus buying armor packs and hoping and praying you'll get it because the rates are extremely low on it. The drop rate. And thank you for all the subscribers who subscribed to me so far. I've gotten a lot of subscribers based off just Dragon Blaze alone, so definitely appreciate everybody subscribing, looking at my videos, asking me questions, liking some of them at least. That's pretty awesome, guys. I'm, I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this for me, too, but more for you guys because the Dragon Blaze players are kind of getting back in. There's tons of videos out now, but they're really old. Only the ones that are more up-to-date, mm -hmm. the ones you need to be paying attention to because the older ones you're not really going to get any useful information out of. And I am very thankful they didn't nerf our, our heroes because I mean man you know spending over 16 million rubies power up basically once and finally getting to the power that I've been wanting to get to and I still want to make them a, a lot more stronger I mean whew, man that that sucks like when they did that they made it really hard to get them let me tell you the second impact characters but Still lots more videos to do as well. Still have to do the raw video. Still have to do deep dive character series, which we're still going to be getting into that 
there's tons of content I have, which I'm very happy that I'm making more content. I think there's other content I was going to make. I have to remember. Um, but yeah, we're going to finish making these. So I'll try not to make this video too long. We're going to go ahead and finish up. See, we're making all these heroes, which is awesome. And yeah, definitely power up your heroes, guys. I've been hearing a little bit that the new heroes are hard to get. Um, definitely got power up your heroes. Um, Camille is very, very useful for her revive effect. And then obviously, I forgot her name. Um, uh, the third impact healer. The one that whenever she dies, she revives everybody, including herself. She's very useful for that. Um, it is required to have three encanters, I'm pretty sure, and three healers. So the rest has to be like strong characters in order to kind of get through that. Last one. Oh, yeah, I already made her. That's right. All right, so let's go ahead and just mass power these guys up real quick and just see what we get. Oh, we're gonna pop everybody, might as well, so. Wow, my fourth impacts are almost at a, uh, almost, almost at a million. 102,000, jeez, 156, man, that's nuts, that's awesome, and that's also before treasures, which we won't do treasures in this video, I'll eventually do my treasures later, and you know, put all their armors and stuff on, but, up, oh, Star of Heroes, ho ho, yes, yes, guys, I forgot about this too, see, unlocking all your heroes allows you to get the Star of Heroes conditionings, See, and that's more rubies coming in my pocket right there. This is why it's so important to make all the heroes too, because you get this. And then you get extra abilities as well. And that is sweet. That is uh that is tons of sweetness there. Lots of free rubies. Also get extra power-ups and stuff. They're awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, anyways, guys, that is today's video. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe as you're on your way out. I'll be doing a lot more. Don't forget to do your jackpot event. Don't forget to stay tuned for the next video as we collect our remainder of rewards. Making all these heroes, it feels good to finally have them. Now I may have a shot at conquering the uh, Odyssey attacking team. Um, Odyssey attacking team, finally. The sixth stage we may have a chance to actually opportunity to actually conquer it finally because man that thing is hard um, let's see we'll do two there and we will do And then we'll go ahead and open up these as well since we're, since we're here, why not? But guys, yep, that would be it for this video. Let's go ahead and end off with opening up some packs and let's just kind of see what we get. Not open for anything too special here. Very nice treasure card for Helios. Treasures, very nice. Souls, awesome. All right. Well, I will see you for the next one. I'm not sure what I'm going to do next, but I'll definitely keep that in mind. I have tons of videos to do. I guess we can go start on the D Dive series, unless there's anything else I need to talk about at this current moment. But I hope you guys like and enjoy. And hey, thank you for coming by. We'll see you for the next one.